One, two, three. Sorry, Bobby. And Bobby number two. Has to be done. Do, 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 do. Wow, look. How many animals do you think Rusty shot? That's a hell of a lot of bullets. That makes me a bit worried. Okay, I guess we continue down the trail then. Not that I mind. Senseless murder. Violence. It's all good. Trees getting eaten by the darkness. Damn that! What the hell do you do to the darkness? Do you insult its band or something? Jeez. Oh, Alan! Quiet. It's not the right darkness. Do, 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 do. Hooray! A checkpoint. I love checkpoints. Hello. Yes, this is Alan. Yeah, Forget darkness. About it, Barry. It's just me going crazy. Forget about uh, Barry, it's just me being an asshole. Oh, jeez. You're not crazy. I wish you were crazy, but you're not crazy. Ow, be careful. Stay in the cabin. Don't open the door for anyone. I mean it. Because I'm going to come back, and I'm going to gut you. You know, he's going to gut him. Just because he's like that. Drop hazard. Really? I suppose unless you throw yourself over the edge, sure. Are there any signs to warn yourself that you will die if you do something dumb? Okay. Ooh, manuscript page. Where are we now? Rusty- oh, I haven't even got this one! In that Lovely. last instant of consciousness, Rusty thought about Rose. He was older than she was. Rose was barely out of her teens. Dodgy! She made him feel young, and forget what a train wreck his long dead marriage had been. He still wore the ring. He'd been waiting for her to tell him to take it off. Now she never would. Because Alan Wake murdered the shit out of him. That's because Alan is a douche. Seriously, Alan, you gotta stop murdering the crap out of people. It's, it's kind of rude. Just, just saying. You murder the crap out of someone. They die. Their dreams go unfulfilled. Rose will no longer have an older sugar daddy. All good things. Then I realised I could be Rose's older sugar daddy. She probably wanted some domestic abuse. I could give that to her. In the right kind of way. No, Alan! No domestic abuse for you! You're banned! Lover's Peak? Lover's Peak was at the far oh, yellow. end of the nature. Screw that! Yellow! Oh, I goddamn love yellow. Let's do it. <clears throat> give me yellow or give me death. Stop being so tired. What are you, like, 50? You run like two feet. Come on, man. Moonshine Cave! Side of the frequent bootlegger activity throughout the prohibition. Cool. Wait, what state are we in? I wasn't paying attention. Mmm, shotgun. Delicious shotguns. Yes. Batteries. Wait, you give me a shotgun and a shotgun ammo? I'm disappointed. Fine. <laughs> I love this, by the way. Look, look. Okay, so, shotgun. Comes out of Mandy Cardigan. Gun. Disappears into Mandy Cardigan. Where does it go? It's a mystery. Like, his manly cardigan is like an alternate universe of different... He just keeps an entire wardrobe full of violence and abuse in his cardigan. This is my club. I use it to beat down people. This is my knuckle duster. I use it to beat up cops. And this is my shotgun. I use it for murder. Very good, Alan. I'm pleased with your vast variety of violent weapons. Be quiet, Skeletor, or I'll beat you over the head with them. Very good. Hmm. <gasps> telephone! What are the can full of? Ooh, the stuff on the telephone. <gasps> no! Bobbies! Damn you, Bobbies! Stay back, Bobby! I have no quarrel with you, sir. Well, except for the fact I'm shooting you. It's not really a quarrel, more of a just blatant murder. Whoa! Ow! Sirs, I'm reloading. Give me a sec. Ooh. <sighs> I realised the more I did this, the more enjoyment I found out of it. Maybe one day, I could do this to real people too. You heard it here first. Alan Wake, sneering psychopath in waiting. Beep. 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 Lover's Peak? Alright, my darlings, let's go to Lover's Peak. It sounds lovely. You can find us at Lover's Peak in Wiltshire. Probably. 
Well, probably any mountains in Wilshire. Let's go Swindon the mountain. Ha! I don't want to go to Lover's Peak. Let's go the other way. Maybe we can find some killer dogs or something. Not to kill dogs. Killer dogs. I don't want to kill dogs. Dogs are pretty cool. Oh! I found a manuscript page. Harry meets Rose. Nobody in Bright Falls seemed to know where Al was, but Rose. No, we've done this one. We've done this one, fool! Ah, it's this Agent one. Nightingale Probably. didn't want to be in Bright Falls. These little communities revolted him, and he didn't like the trees or the coffee. Wow, it's like Alan Wake. He now knew that impossible horrors lurked behind the storefronts and smiles. He desperately wanted to turn the car around and just drive until he passed out or ran out of road and booze. But he had a job to do. He had a rider to catch, at any cost. We had to stop him. He kept writing terrible, terrible things. We couldn't let that happen anymore. Seriously, we can't. It would be dreadful. Do, do, do. Oh, there's light up there. That's usually a good sign. Let's head towards the light. I've actually been wondering so far in this game if I actually have to murder everybody I see. Is this kind of survival horror esque right? Uh oh. Have to not murder everyone I see. Uh, it's getting kind of dark and dingy here, Alan. Should probably move towards that light I saw. Come on, you can do it! Run for more than two feet, Alan! Do it! Excellent! Oh, It's a big statue of a bear holding his balls. Impressive. Ooh. Let me just absorb the shotgun. Excellent. And then put it back into my manly cardigan of universal weapons. I put the shotgun behind the sofa, along with the machine gun and the grenade launcher. I thought I might need it. Oh my god! No, Bobby! Please! I really don't want to hurt you, Bobby. Whoa! He's a super guy. Whoa! What the hell? What are you, an American football player? Knock it off! Bang! 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 Murder! Hooray! And reload. Rinse and repeat. Hello. I can see you now. Bzzzt. Bzzzt. Whoop, not today. That's an unpleasant looking sickle you have there, sir. You know you use those for farming. Trust me. I come from farming land. Excellent. The great old one. Oh my god. It's trees Cthulhu. Well, luckily Alan Wake's already completely crazy, so it doesn't make any real difference. Alan Wake for Targon. Alan Wake for Targon. <laughs> Whoa! Dudes! Not cool! Spawning stuff behind me should mean. Ow. As is throwing nasty weapons at me. Just backpedal. Wait. Light! No light. I guess one I saw light. Okay. Ow. I realised after I shot Bobby Singer for at least 50 times that I don't think he was coming back. I guess one saw some light. Maybe it was that. Oh no, it's down there! That was quite a way, actually. No, oh, well, never mind. I like the darkness effect, but the blurriness is kind of ruining the visuals slightly. It looks... I mean, the blurriness is, adds a bit of atmosphere, I guess, but... No! Actually, you know what? Screw this. Oh, you're an ass. And I was trying to save ammo instead of murder. Never get any respect, goddamn here. Freaking kids. Oops. God, I did the quick time event wrong. Yay. Okay, and I'm running out of ammo. That's not so good. Beep. That's better. Is that a page? Okay. I turn the corner, afraid of what the flashlight's beam might reveal. Suddenly, a roughly painted symbol of a torch glowed in the light. Behind it, hidden by a rock, sat a battered metal trunk. It was here for a reason. Packed with supplies. 
batteries, flares, ammo, things you need to make it through the darkness of the night. Something left behind by someone who knew what I knew, and more. Well, I have a theory, right? Or I would if I wasn't sneeze and full of cold. Hold on. Excuse me. So, my theory is that I reckon... I'm just putting it down here so I can say, and if I come back to it later, and I was right, I could be really cool about it, that all these items and stuff are left behind with a torch symbol. Alan has already done this, like, a week ago, and the week he's forgotten his week, and something's going on. That's my theory. Whether that's right or not, I don't know, but that's, that's what I'm going with. That's what I reckon. Alternatively, Alan could be the villain, and he's trying to kill himself and snip bears! Oh my god, freaking bears! Awesome! Where's my shotgun? Oh, gonna kill me some darkness bears. Sweet. Let's do this, Alan. Got some bears to murder. Look, there's probably like bear evidence of a shirt. Wait, is that Alice's shirt? Ooh. Wait, that's not ooh, that's Alice the goblin. Never mind. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll, I'll protect you all from her goblinness. Bears? Bears, anybody? That's not a bear. Neither's that. I was lied to. You guys aren't friggin' bears. Oh crap. There's loads of these jerks. Ow. Stop it, Bobby. You're not an American football player. You don't need to charge. Ow. You don't need to throw. Ow. Knock it off. No. No, Mr. Wake. No. How will you sneer when you're dead? I was so disappointed. Okay, plan B. Let's not die. And let's not run either. Running is... Wait a minute! They're trying to trap me! I just saw you run around there, jerk. You goddamn non-bears. You're all been trying to be like, oh, I'm Bobby Singer. But you're not really, are you? Yeah. Reload, Alan. Reload. Oh! Double kill, and I got an achievement. Are you proud of me, folks? Oops. My bad. I like taking hikes, says Alan. Murdering as I go. Goodbye. Alan is a killing machine. My god. By Alan, I mean me, because I'm like, of course, the evil puppet master as always. Evil! Quiet, Skeletor. No one asked your opinion. For your safety, stay on the designated hiking. No! I don't want to. Ha ha ha! No, there's nothing here. I gain nothing for my efforts. I hope you're happy. Oh well, let's push on to through the through tree. Her. We gotta go to Lover's Peak. I expected to find neither love nor a peak up there, because this game wasn't that obvious. But I persevered nonetheless. Well, Alan, what are you going to do now? Well, I'm going to find my wife and then uh, get back together with her. What does that even mean? Well, I'm going to hit her, of course. Say something along the lines of, God damn it, Alice! And then carry on. I approve, sir. I thought you might. Nothing here? How's this? Oh, it's a really ancient tree. <laughs> I sneered at the tree, realizing if I couldn't enjoy the tree, no one could. I'm guessing I can't go this way then. Uh, Lover's Peak. So I guess we gotta sort of go this way. <laughs> Beep. Wait, I have no idea which one we've got. I think we've done them one. I've actually done one too many. I don't know. I apologise. This is what happens when I pause at the recording. I have no idea what I'm doing anymore. It said drop hazard, but the only drops were dirty as fuck. Bop, bop, bop. Beep. Cool. Do I get down there already? Yeah. Oh, oh, no! Whoops. 
Sorry, Adam. My bad. Didn't actually realize you could fall off.